Meghan Markle looked dazzling as she joined royal family members for the 50th anniversary of Prince Charles's investiture, but was that the last time we will see her before she goes on maternity leave? A heavily pregnant Duchess of Sussex has flitted between countries over the last couple of weeks despite rapidly nearing her due date. Meghan, 37, flew to New York in mid-February for a nailist baby shower attended by close friends before she and Prince Harry spent three days in Morocco. Earlier today, she joined the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge, plus the Duchess of Cornwall, at an event marking Prince Charles's 50 years of royal service. Accompanied by her husband Prince Harry, 34, Meghan arrived looking radiant and fresh-faced for the celebration. She wore a gold and silver brocade gown teamed with a white Amanda Wackley coat and stilettos. The Duchess is believed to be expecting her little bundle of joy in late April this year, which means her due date could be just a few weeks away. Kensington Palace has not given any indication of when Meghan will officially go on maternity leave. But it could be sooner than thought following reports the royal has already had a few false alarms thinking she might be in labor. A Kensington Palace insider told New Idea, Meghan and Harry, and the entire palace, are on high alert because doctors have said that this baby could come any day now. There's been quite a few false alarms where they thought she was in labor and made arrangements to go to the hospital. It's been a huge roller coaster ride. At one point they even made an emergency dash to the hospital in the middle of the night thinking Meghan was in labor, only to be checked out and given the all-clear. The source added, apart from the constant Braxton Hicks contractions, doctors have said that the baby has engaged and she's showing all the signs that the baby will be here sooner rather than later. Even though the official palace statement said the baby wasn't due until April, the actual due date is a few weeks before that. Senior royals just wanted to give Meghan and Harry a bit of breathing room with all the attention on her pregnancy. However, Kensington Palace seemed to play down the rumors today, confirming Meghan still has another royal engagement to come. The palace tweeted, The Duke and Duchess of Sussex will attend a Commonwealth Day event at Canada House at Canadian UK on Monday 11 March. The event will showcase and celebrate the diverse community of young Canadians living in London and around the UK. When did Kate go on maternity leave? Kate, the Duchess of Cambridge went on maternity leave a month before giving birth to her third child Prince Louis. But with her firstborn Prince George, Kate made her final public appearance on June 15, 2013. George was born on July 22 meaning he arrived five weeks and two days later after Kate's final royal engagement. 